Alright, so let's draw the head of the snake. And obviously we are going to use the graphics. So G dot draw image. And I'm sure you already know that it's coming from the image list dot images. And the snake head is in the image with the index of 5. And now we have to obviously draw it in X and Y coordinates. And those X and Y coordinates for the head are stored obviously in snake X and Y with the index of 0, which is the head index for the X. But we have to multiply it by 35 pixels. And it's the same for the Y. So snake X, Y with the index of 0 and Y coordinates multiplied by 35. And that's just how simple it is, because we already have the head coordinates from the previous code. So here we're simply drawing it and multiplying it by the 35 pixels. And that's really it. So all that is to do now is to assign another snake field to these coordinates, because obviously the head of the snake is part of the snake, so it's not a free field. So we need to assign to our game board field with these indexes. So again, I'm just going to copy them. So it's going to be the snake XY for the X and snake XY for the Y coordinate. So these are the two dimensions on our game board field, so the X and Y, and we'll assign it the game board field dot snake. So now it's not a free field, it's a part of the snake. And the last thing to do is to refresh the game board. So picture game board dot refresh. So this is the code. And all that is left is to enjoy the game. So let's play it and see if it works as expected.